Good afternoon year two, what an absolutely beautiful day it is today. It is so warm and so sunny, it's absolutely gorgeous. So I hope you've had a really lovely week focusing on our mental health challenges and thinking about kindness. Now we are going to continue with that today, thinking about how we can show kindness and also thank the others for their kindness they show us too. So we are going to continue with an activity but before we do I'd like to say a huge thank you to Nathan who showed me lots of kindness. When I went into school yesterday I was greeted with an absolutely beautiful parcel and he'd made me something special so I'm going to share that with you at the end of the video. It's absolutely beautiful, it nearly made me do a little cry. So today's activity then you are going to be making a kindness medal. Now, it could be a kindness medal or it could be a kindness certificate, depending on what you've got at home. So, you are going to make one of these so that you can give it to somebody when they have shown that they have been kind to somebody else. So, you might want to have a little think about who has showed you kindness at the moment. It could be even your parents for looking after you, even though they're working from home, they've been helping you with your schoolwork. It could be a friend who's been checking in on you, making sure you're okay. It's completely up to you who you want to send it to. So, I'm going to show you some examples now. You can be as creative as you want to be. You might not have much in your house, you might want to just use paper and pen and draw a kindness medal. You might want to make a certificate. You might want to use a kindness medal using a paper plate. It's completely up to you. You might even want to make something outside with flowers and leaves and take a picture of it and that could be your kindness medal. Completely up to you. So I'll show you some examples and then after the examples I'm going to show you my very special gift from me. Right, now for ta to show Nathan's gift. So, it came in an absolutely beautiful package and the first thing in the package was this beautiful card and it says Miss Harry's and a big smiley face. So that made me happy straight away. And then inside it said, to Miss Harry's, you said you were missing your family so I made you a hug from me to make you feel better. You can share it if you like, I don't mind, love Nathan. And even that was enough to make me smile. Now, when I opened the package, I thought, what's this? And I stretched it out. And I stretched it out. And Nathan had made me my very own hug. So when I'm feeling a bit sad and lonely, I can put it around me. And I can give myself a nice big hug. Hug. Now, I love this idea so much. I actually made these with the year one and FS2 children in school yesterday. So, if you want an extra challenge, you could make a hug and you could actually send this to your grandparents who you can't hug at the moment or somebody you really miss and you'd love to give a giant cuddle to. So, that really made my day. So, thank you so much, Nathan. That was very, very kind of you. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, can't wait to see what you do and I'll see you soon.